Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, today is a public holiday in Canberra, um, which doesn't really affect me much. I'll just sit here um, because Mondays I don't have anything on normally anyway. But um, yeah, I just got back from catching up with a friend who I hadn't seen in forever since last year. Um, yeah, I last saw her last year, so that was really nice to spend some time with her. Um, we just went out for brunch, did a quick bit of shopping, and yeah, so I just got back. Um, yeah, now just going to spend my day doing some studying. I might go and do the puzzle for a bit now, because um, I haven't done it for a few days. I don't think I've done it since, I don't even remember, Thursday, last week. But... Yeah, I might go do some of the puzzle that we're currently working on and then I'll just do some studying. Also for me, yesterday was a sad day in regards to the French Open tennis. Everyone that I was going for, like all my favourites lost. So, yay. Because in the morning when I woke up, McGrutha was playing, who is one of my favourites. Because it was like still going from the night before. Because it starts in the evening for us here in Australia. But... She was up in the third set when I woke up, but then ended up losing, which was sad. Um, and then Halep lost last night, which was actually quite a big shock, but Sviatek, or whatever, I don't know her name. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, just played really well and won, so that was disappointing. And then Zverev also lost later on too, so yay. <laughs> I don't really know who to go for now in either of them, I mean, Surely Nadal's a shoe in, right? I mean, by the time I upload this, it will be well over, but surely Nadal will win. Otherwise, I don't know, Djokovic or team? I don't know. I don't really know who to go for on the men's side. Um, I'm just kind of assuming Nadal will win, but who knows? Anything could happen in tennis. It's so unpredictable. And um, the women's side, I'm thinking Kvitova I'll go for, but I don't really know because all my favourites are out and it's sad. <laughs> But even and like we haven't even the second week's only just starting so that's great anyway that was my random tennis ramble don't you love when you're just about to go to sleep and thunderstorm starts great I hate rain on the roof it drives I honestly I know a lot of people love it I don't understand how <laughs> I actually hate it so yay I should have gone to bed earlier that was my plan but I did not follow that plan. If I went to bed early, I wouldn't be having to listen to this right now. Because <laughs> once I'm asleep, it's fine. I can sleep through it. It's just getting to sleep. But anyway, I'm going to go to bed. I had work today. I just did a few hours. Um, and then I finished a bit earlier. So that, because I have a, a psychology exam. Um, I think not like a formal timed one just to they put it out and you've got to do it and submit it by eight o'clock um so I've just submitted that it's all done felt all right I think um I mean it's not too hard because it's not timed and it's not closed book <laughs> which is a lifesaver but anyway I'm now just going to redo my nail polish because I just did not get around to doing it on Friday when I normally try and do it but um it's not too bad but time to redo it i'm gonna go with this color there's another sinful colors one in 1106 cinderella it's very pretty except i think it goes on quite like it's not like overly what it is but i can build it up a bit hopefully because it's very pretty in the bottle it's like a shimmery pale blue I guess inspired by Cinderella's dress. I got back from work a bit over an hour ago, did an extra day this week. Um, that being today. Um, I've also got the hiccups, which I can't get rid of, so yay. But um, yeah, Amy is on her way over to pick me up and we're going to hang out this evening. Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to say, just thought I'd do a quick vlog update. Um, but yeah, I am just grabbing my jacket and getting my stuff ready. Um, yeah. 
I got back from hanging out with Amy about an hour ago. Um, it is now exactly 10 o'clock. Um, I just fed the rabbits their dinner and put them to bed. Um, and yeah, now I'm just about to get into some more studying. But I got a package today. I don't know why it's not that exciting, but um, I'm trying to jazz up this vlog. It's a book <laughs> that I ordered back in April. Like I pre-ordered it and it just got released whenever it was. I don't know, not too long ago, but yeah. Let me try and open this, but my opening skills are not great. So this will be interesting. It's actually quite heavy, like heavier than when I, it was on the bench when I got home from work. I picked it up and was like, whoa, that is heavier than I was expecting. I don't even remember what the book is other than the fact that it's by Craig Judge on Dancing with the Stars and Strictly Come Dancing in the UK Oh gosh, I cannot do this with one hand, one second Okay, I've just opened it It looks like this and I completely forgot that it's actually signed by Craig Like, I completely forgot about that That is so cool I cannot wait to read this it feels very fancy. It's very fancy. I cannot wait to read this. I don't actually, what's the, I'll read the blurb. Um, so it's called Dances and Dreams on Diamond Street. Danny sat back in his chair and surveyed the scene. Apart from dancing, entertaining others, whether through food, wine or song, or all of the above, was his greatest pleasure in life. And he had to admit, the sight of his housemates, new and old, all sitting around the table, faces flushed and laughing, made his, made even his cynical heart happy. The meal hadn't been without a couple of tense moments, though. He wanted to christen Kath's beautiful but dreary boyfriend with the gravy jug. After the way the man had put poor Jewel on the spot about his name, good old Lachlan had soon put him in his place, though. And thankfully, Pete and Lil had behaved themselves. So all in all, it had been a very successful welcome meal. So yeah, one day I'll get around to reading this, but I can't wait. Probably after I finish uni for the year. Because then I'll have ages. And I have heaps of books to read, so. Anyway, just thought I'd add that to vlog. Because otherwise it's probably going to be really boring. So I just thought I'd show my book. <laughs> anyway, I need to study. I am just about to head off to uni. I have a chemistry lab this afternoon. Um, so, yeah, just packing my bag. Um, but look at this sleepy head. <laughs> and I bet your sister's doing the same thing on another bed or in her cat bed. But yes, he's just been here. Now 125, he's been here since about 10? Or even before that? No, I'd say 10. Been here since about 10. There is some funky lighting going on in this car, but otherwise the sun is like right in my eyes. Um, I've just finished my lab. We had to make or synthesize um, that works. I'm using the mirror to block the sun <laughs> we had to synthesize aspirin and paracetamol so yeah my friend did the aspirin and i did the paracetamol um i can insert a groovy image here of what it looks like <laughs> it's not that exciting but yeah it's something and then we did some tlc and of it and yeah um now just picking up my brother from his friend's house we're just like, I'm in the car on the driveway. My dad's gone to go collect him. <laughs> Zeno! <laughs> what is that jump? Zeno! What was I going to say? I've literally forgotten. <laughs> um, but, yeah, had work today. Um, and then did some studying. <laughs> Uh, just went to the shops with my dad. We got some lavender, white lavender for the yard. My mum's been wanting it and finally found some. Because we've already had some last year. But 
we had other bushes but they died in the winter so now we're just going full lavender anyway um some irrigation stuff and then some groceries for dinner and some cat food and treats because Zelda was running out of food and they both no more treats so yeah now I'm just gonna get back into some more studying um nothing particularly exciting right now for the vlog but just thought I'd do a little update it is a while later now um as you can see I have gone ready for bed and all that have a shower done all the things it is very close to midnight I'm just about to go to bed but I just thought I'd update the vlog um I didn't mention it before but um Basically, we went to the shops, we, um, we went to Coles, and we got there and we were using the self serve checkout thing, um, because we needed a couple items, and, um, the payment went through, but then it just crashed, and, like, wouldn't go beyond that, and it was just, like, <laughs> I don't exactly remember what it was saying, but it basically ended up all shutting down. But luckily, we managed to actually get our payment through, and so we could go, um, but, yeah, and then they ended up, um, because we left to go to another shop and then we came back into the building it's in and like the doors were all down because we were like, is it just the self-serve? Is it everywhere? But then, yeah, so all, they had like shut the shop so like you couldn't go in, um, which was really weird to see at like 4.30 in the evening, afternoon, I mean, um, but yeah. And then, turns out, I found out later on in the news, it was nationwide, it shut down. I thought it was just our area, but apparently it was somehow nationwide. I don't know how this is exciting for the vlog, it's just something weird. So, I just thought I'd vlog, I really need to stop wiping my hair. Um, it's just something weird, unusual. So I thought I'd just mention it in the vlog. Random shutdown, which I've never seen before. Um, 2020 keeps being weird. <laughs> but, anyway that happened um yeah I'm gonna go to bed now haven't done a lot this evening watched an episode of Utopia um with my dad downstairs on tv um yeah gave me rabbits a cuddle did some studying that's about it it hasn't been very oh I forgot to take my earrings out darn it I need to take them out they would be not fun to sleep in because I love how the whole time I was getting ready for bed I was like earrings but then I never did it <laughs> anyway good night excuse my messy hair I just got back from work it was a long day why did I say it was it was a long day I literally never said twas aside from I don't know reading Shakespeare if I even Shakespeare I don't even know anyway um yeah it was a bit of a long day but yeah now I've just got to get on with some studying because I have a fair bit to do um by Monday so yay um yeah not much else to say. I'm covering a bit of fur. That's fun. <laughs> anyway, time to get on with studying. It's worming day. Oh, he's okay. keen. <laughs> I don't need to show that. It's just getting a worming tablet. Ready? <laughs> he's like, I don't want that. No, he's not good. There's his sister. His sister's come to get hers done. Oh, good one. <laughs> say no. Take the pill. Don't oh. <laughs> This is not working. What, read the instructions. <laughs> this is the instruction. Come on, Zaya. Oh. Did you eat it? No. No, you didn't. No, that's it. I think you did eat it. I did. Did you eat it? And have a drink. I did, I got it in. Do you want a treat? Wash it down. Say no. I've got nothing to happen to me. <laughs> Yeah, go get the other one. Look at Spiky back. Shadow, <laughs> <laughs> go. Shadow, hey, come here. She looks suspicious. <laughs> She's like something's going on. Oh, you think she didn't hear me? <laughs> Where's Zenith? Oh, she's got Zandra. <laughs> She's always had dandruff. She's a bit of a little... Zelda. Zelda, shush. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Zelda, it's okay. You've done it before. Mate, you're not just going <laughs> to eat it. Who do you think they are? <laughs> <laughs> Don't 
John? Is it still <laughs> it's still it's still it? I think so. She has a spell of yeah, she has. Huh? <laughs> I think she has. Do you want a treat? Good cats. Yeah, Tell her. Tell her. Yeah. They just swallow it, they don't bite it. This is a really random filming location, but I was just about to have a shower and realized I need to end the vlog. It is literally two minutes to midnight. Um yeah. Um I don't know what I was gonna say. Played tennis. Um went for a drive later on in the day. Like tennis was in the morning, drive is later on in the day. Got the pen. Oh dear. Um otherwise just been at home studying. Um also watched Junior Master Chef because that started today. Which is really weird watching it now, like the last time it was on was back in 2011 and 10. Um, they had Junior Master Chef, and I was like eight and nine, so like these kids on the show were. I think back then it was eight to thirteen years, whereas this year it's ten to fourteen years old. So I was like the same age as some of them, otherwise younger, and it just feels different watching it now. Like I still like it and all that. It just kind of puts me to shame <laughs> and like my cooking skills are not that great and I wish I could cook like that but anyway um yeah I am gonna have a show watch some of the French Open men's final don't know if I'll bother like how much I probably won't watch the whole thing because it could go on for five hours who knows but I'll catch at least some of the start but I'm gonna have a shower now that's about to start and then I'll watch some of that and then eventually go to bed. So yeah, don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe to my channel if you want to see more videos and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!